Might not be able to hear me yet. I'll turn the music down a bit. Piao. There we go. Hope you're all well. Today we're after affecting. After effects is affecting the afters. Bit of uh, Weeble and Bob, as promised. Here we go. Um. So yeah, fun times. Uh, new computer, thanks to Cyber Power systems uk um it's nice it's a nice computer this one will not blue screen repeatedly at random points just because it's got too hot because it doesn't get hot it's it's crazy cool i've seen it in action here i can show you my temperatures now look here we go piao 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 here we go look at these temperatures this is more like it. i'm running after effects i'm streaming i'm playing your music i've got a camera going and what's the temperature now? It's it's 43 on some. You know, it's nice. It's working. It's just working. Also, I've got a bit more headroom should it get warm. <laughs> so I'm very happy with Cyber Power System. You should see it. It's a, it's a nice thing. It's down here. It's all white and shiny with LEDs in and water cooled to keep the noise down. And it has like acoustic foam in. And uh, yeah. It was, it was very reasonably price. Uh, yeah, check them out if you're looking for a PC because I am happy. And they sent it to me, like, for free. Because apparently I am a fancy lad. Yay. Um, I'm, I'm so happy. Not happy that I had to, you know, get rid of my old one. But, you know, it was old. It was old. So, you know, we can live and move on. Let's get on with this, shall we? Yes, let's. Right, let's hide these core temperatures because that was just me showing off. Look how cool my thing is. How are we doing? Anyone there? Yes, people are here. Hello. I'm going to belch. <coughs> I've just had a can of pop. So that's always going to happen. Um, so yes, Weeble and Bob are back eventually. Look what it... So, if you were here for the last stream, I don't know if we covered this, but I'm using a thing called joysticks and sliders, let, which lets me do this sort of thing, which is control um, the character really simply from basically an on-screen joystick, which doesn't appear in the final video, obviously. Um, it's all nulls. Um, but yeah, and here's another cool thing about this computer. It's, it's a bit pokey, so we can pretty much preview in real time uh, <laughs> and then Bob rolls on, obviously. Um, so at the <laughs> moment, <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Okay, so at the moment, um, what we're looking at here is just like the weeble thing. Um, here's another nice thing about joysticks and sliders is that you can move it up a level. So ideally, we would have the final composition which would be let's give it a name because that's a sensible thing to do um, this one is about dead clowns because you know dead clowns it's comedy gold isn't it um, oh hey 
Hey, thanks for following. I can't see that. Could you see that? I can make this screen bigger now. I can see. Sorry, I missed that. But whoever followed, thank you very much. I'd rewind and find out, but I didn't. So. Um. Yes, we're gonna make a uh, sensibly sized thing because at the moment, obviously, this is oversized. You'll see when I bring it in. The Weeble Rocker. Here we go. But also, so clearly, that's way too big for Weeble and Bob. He's in the wrong place. You know how Weeble and Bob goes. But it is now 16.9. So, it also means I can zoom in. And because it is all vector based, I think, in theory, I should be able to scale forever. Let's see. And it'll maintain. The only thing that isn't scaling nicely is the outline, which is a stroke. But again, I can change that, thinking about it, to make that on this level, layer, and that would work nicely. Again, let's have a look at this. Static, Weeble static is just a thing, just a thing. Potentially that's a thing. Let's hide the thing. All right, here you can see how I've done the um, shading on him as well because I'm smart like that there's nice things going off with this model um so yeah I can if I made him here like that in theory that's sorted where was the clown I've just called it dead apparently oh yeah look I've sorted out that you can see hopefully see the edges there hello Johnny 02 no Johnny 002 or double O two. Um, yeah, so I can scale infinitely again. But that is weird. Why is it doing that? It's something to look in. But I doubt we're ever going to be this close on his face. I mean, we're 300 times as big as we need to. Oh, is this a... That is interesting what he's doing there. I'm going to have to look into what that is. Oh, I think I know it is. It's the shading there. Let's have a quick look there. Shade is a thing. But if we hide it, let's find out. Yeah, there's something funky going on there. I know what it is. So what I've done with that is make um, a mask over the shade so it behaves exactly the mask is basically the same as that and uh yeah so if i make that continually rasterize as well which just makes it fancy and makes it more victory we will get back to the place where it doesn't happen do 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 at 300 look we're all good now no weirdness but let's get back to 100 percent Mm. There is literally no reason for me to run the stroke earlier on. Run the stroke. Let's not continue to rasterize at a second anyway, because we don't need to. If we need to later, we will turn it on. Hmm. That's very nice of you to say so, Johnny002. I will try and keep up the good work. Firstly, by bringing back Weeble and Bob. This one's a fun one. It's actually got live action stuff in as well. So it's a mixture of like animation and video. And we're going to do some grading on the live action bits. Um, it's kind of like the classic thing where we used to end with a weird advert. Whoa. Hey. Luca Jarts. Luca Jarts. Thank you for follow, follow. Um. Man, working on effects is a lot of work. I just use it casually for easy effects. Premiere can't do. Um, it's not hard. You just need to learn what you're doing. After Effects is the best. It's vastly superior to Flash. You can do all kinds of crazy lovelies. Um, this is actually the second time I've made this. Because the first time I tried to make this. Let's save this for now. I'll show you. Um, it did not run at anything like the speed this does just because it, there, there is some weirdness to joysticks and sliders it does do like shape 
path changes, but you have to tell it to sort of render them out before it actually shows them. This one is there's no actual path changes. It's all done with ma like masks and stuff uh, to make it work properly. Right. So this is it at fifty percent and half. So it's basically full res. Let's go back to the actual thing and rename this because dead is not one. Right. Dead clown. Oh, we also wanted to change the background tool. Perfect. I'm wondering if I should soften out this shadow here. Uh, okay, that makes sense, Mr. Clotish. Cotlolish. Cotlolish. <laughs> Mouthful. Just a video editor and not an animator. That's fine, but you can still comp and everything in After Effects. It's very useful. You can do all the. It's worth learning it properly. I mean, not many animators animate fully in After Effects. You totally can. Like this in front of you now, the Weeble is entirely After Effects. It's, there is no uh, Illustrator files or anything brought in from anywhere else. It's literally all After Effects. To keep you know it's speedy 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 what we will have to do at some point is sort out bob because obviously you can't you know, bob's a bit weird at the moment um but we have to be careful when we like because i want to bring all the controllers into the main timeline so i can literally have like this side weeble controllers this side bob controllers everything on the main timeline animate everything right there in front of me with everything just rolling along nicely um everyone's thinking maybe i should soften out the uh shadow i can do that very quickly if i can remember i think it's this layer yes it is probably do it with a blur rather than anything else <laughs> Come here, there's a fly in my vision. See, I'm not sure I do know one of the... I don't think it needs it. I kind of like the... Um, sharpness of it. Mm. Mm. One pixel blur. It's subtle, but... <sighs> no, I like the sharpness. I'm sorry, I've had a look at it. And I've made an executive decision. I'm going to keep that just as like sharpy sharp. Hey, Ruby. Thank you for your help the other um, week. <laughs> While my computer crashed every five seconds. It's not doing it no more. Hey, 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 hey. And I, you know, I've got an extra three terabytes of storage now, which is handy. Um, I've, I've filled it up with this old school VSTs. Right, let's go on with this, shall we? So, Bob is, uh, Weeble's kind of working. This is the thing. So if we go to the static one, which I do need to, it's in here. Okay, so as we animate Weeble, he goes about his biz, his eyes, eyes. Donkey is good, thank you, Ruby. In fact, I need to draw Donkey at some point. And Monkey, and all the other things that I need to draw. I need to draw all of those and bring... I'm going to redesign Monkey, because he actually appears in this one. Um, so, yeah. I'm wondering, actually, if I can bring this into the existing one I've animated. No, we're going to do it all, you know, again, because that's more sensible. Right. So the eyes, eye swap. Not very interesting, but I can swap the eyes pretty quickly and they still behave. So I've got so far normal, uh, then surprised and then happy and then a little bit angry, but not. Oh, hello. Oh, there's a shine appearing on there. Might need to sort that out. Let's have a look at his eyes. So, angry, angry, angry. Why is there a shine? Because I put the shine in a weird place, probably. 
when does the shine happen this is the only problem like once the initial setup's done i'm going to be laughing so hard like ha ha right oh you'll notice as he talks his head goes up and down that's some weird code they've done so they're a lot more animated than they ever were always name your layers what an idiot thing to not do right what we got it's not that what are you it's this one that's annoying see oh um things to do there kind of works anyway but hey we'll leave that for now we can figure out a way around that to be honest i don't really need shines i'll just keep them on for now right so yes we will rock her so i've got uh miffed is what i've called it obviously and full-on anger he's so angry right now so angry look at that angry face sad have i done sad i haven't designed sad yet i haven't designed quizzical yet and then there was one more that i needed so we need sad quizzical probably suave it's generally suave um the shine is something i put in if you look at the eyes there i've done the shine in a very specific way that as he rotates they maintain like <sighs> you'll see it's like if here we go so look as i move him round the shine remains in the same angle so the lighting is consistent basically <laughs> that's why the shine is the way it is I've just ruined everything by doing that. Get rid of that. You go. Remind me. Do, do, do. So I don't need you there. Yes, Cammy. My daughter's here. Um, where's the child with the big pen boy? It's downstairs in the kitchen. Alright. Say bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> that was Cammy. Oh! I'm talking to everyone, Cammy. Yeah, school holidays. Fun times. It's getting warm in here. Right. So we need to sort out the eyes. We have that, 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 that. that. So we've gone from angry to... What was the la next one? Sad. Angry, sad, quizzical and suave as i believe it was let's just check this is anger sad yeah okay so the next layer to do is sad let's sort it out Anger, sad. I don't know why I have so many things. So we need little sad eyes here. I'm going to change the background colour. I like working on hot pink. It makes me feel more Weeble and Bobby straight away. We're going to make the eyes sad. We're going to... Mm, am I going to mask them? Screw it, why not? No, we're not going to mask them. Are we going to mask them? So for sad eyes, you want to kind of like, mm, mm, mm. we need some eyebrows in there for sure. I think. Oh, I see. That's interesting. Okay, so it all has to exist within here. Oh, this is slightly more fun than I expected it to be be as i i haven't looked at this file for a while due to pc whatever's it's fine let's get the color what the fuck 
No. What? Screw it. Right. Think. Okay. Have I actually? That's my first line, is it? It's annoying. Ah, oh, you muppet. What have you done? Right. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, I've made life so difficult for myself. So I've saved. I don't need to save now anyway. It won't crash. It's very good. Right. It's not going to crash. We're not going to crash. We're not going to lose anything. We haven't even started doing anything yet. So I have made this tricky for myself. Fun times. But since we're here, let us... Let's see. And I see. Oh, good. Our fills have sorted themselves off. So, we want to draw. We do want to draw. It's sort of, why are you gone red? Oh, God. I'll tell you what though, this music isn't making me feel particularly sad, I'll be honest. I need that grey. Oh, you penis. Frankly, you're a penis. Do, 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 do. Right, what layer am I on? Annoying that it's doing this. Don't need you. That looks kind of sad. It might work. Can I copy it? Is the question. Is it you? It is. Really. Ah, oh, anchor points, man. Always sort out your anchor points. No, you. Hey, thank you, Superfill64! Right, where is the. Let's find out by using why. It's down there. That's a silly place for an anchor point. And now, when I swap it, it behaves. It just behaves now. All right, so I think that's pretty sad looking. We could probably go sadder. Hmm, need some eyebrows to make it even more sad. Now is the time we use our lines. It's kind of a... Where's my camera? I need to see my face. Here we go. So it's kind of furrow brows and up at the so sort of, mm, okay let's do this boom great make it nice and thick thick and fill we want to be transparent for you that might be too thick a line. That's pretty good. What are you doing? Stop that. Right. And again, we'll have to you move blooming anchor point
Come on. Come on, you. See how we're looking. That looks pretty sad to me. You gotta agree. That's a pretty sad face. Nice. So. Obviously, they're all on at every point, and we don't want that to happen. We want them to be transparent. What you doing? Oh. Cool beans. Let's change our opacities. Hopefully, that will have changed every opacity. Yes, that I needed. Oh, cool. It's even put keyframes in. That's very good. Very good. Boom, boom. So this is where they'll be. And we put, hopefully we're all on. Yep. Boom, boom. So we now have sad. And then we, hey. You are not the same color. That's what I need. Yes, you're a little too dark. That's weird. Perfect time to change them. Got you. And. Um, got you. Okay. In, hopefully. Yep. So we got angry, sad should now work. Let's just try that. Yep. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I should pay more attention to the chat. I'm looking at the wrong screen. There we go. Look, sad eyes. It's all working. But yeah, again, that shine is causing me issues. I can sort that. It's fine. We'll fix that eventually. All I need to do uh, is change transparencies when certain eyes are selected and then it will work in theory what have i done so let's have a look at the code for the eyes and see if we can quickly figure out what i've done is there any code where's the code living no This is very strange. At some, I must have done it somewhere. The eyes live in here. Hmm. This is the thing when you um spe forget to. Well, I haven't forgot. When you spend time away from something like this, because this is I, I've spent ages making this and. Uh, yeah, that's all joystick. It's totally joystick. So, how is it being done? I did make this. Here we go. Found it. Weeble eyes. Obviously, I was looking in the wrong composition. So, if blah blah blah, if compilation reasonable rocker, oh, there's a checkbox, checkbox, else. This is going to be slightly trickier than doing it the other way. Because it needs to be on for certain things and then off for the rest. So if the eyes are open, like, let's just check this. In th maybe, actually, we've only got one where the shine is valid one. Okay, it's not tricky at all. All I need to do is tell the shine to be on when the eyes are normal. And then all other ones, the shine can be off. Is that going to look weird, though? <laughs> For now, I'm just going to turn the shine off. Because it seems to me 
This is one of those things. Why have you disappeared? There we go. Did we decide it was that? It was that. So we've hidden that for now. We'll think of something. Maybe we'll put it back. Maybe we'll change the shine to something a bit more dotty, lower down. Um, I mean, it doesn't really detract from anything. But now we have sad, and then we need quizzical, which is going to be sort of a... Let's look at our face again. And then remember to change everything back, obviously, to the right screen, because that would be good. So quizzical is like... Tricky. Mm. One eyebrow kind of up, one down. It's very similar to what the suave one's going to be, which is more uh, looking at you, whereas Quizzical's looking away. That's going to be tricky, isn't it? Like you've got to get your eyes to like go to one side when they have no pupils. We have got this. We've got this in the bag. Right, let's work on Quizzical then. So basically here yeah, we need normalize. Right, let's just drop back. So if you press U on the app face, this is a top tip. Hotkeys. If press U it just shows you the lay um, keyframes you've got in action rather than everything you can change it makes it a lot easier to find your way around so what I need is normalize which we've got and then we're gonna need some eyebrows which we haven't got and this is uh, quizzical so slightly squinty forward facing eye which would be that one And a raised eyebrow over the back one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I can just blank this out with white. That would make sense. Let's do that. On you, and I do want you to be white. I've not swapped back again, have I? <laughs> what a tail! Ah, me inept. As you can see, we've progressed a lot since I forgot to swap back. I'm not going to swap cameras no more because it's just idiotic i will always forget i think it's safe to say right here we go right so we're gonna squinty squint eyebrow down do we take the top of this eye down as well yes looking at my face i'm saying yes he would look annoyed right now more squinty is what I'm after than annoyed though. It's quizzical though, we're looking away aren't we? So theoretically it's more... I want to give a sense of looking away. I think that's better. We'll see when the eyebrows are in. So, what's the eyebrow doing? I'm going to have to swap to my face. I'm sorry. It's kind of... Down? Up, down, down, up, down. Hey! 
smart fungus i did in get a new computer it is much better it doesn't crash uh yes cyber power systems uk cyberpower.co.uk if i plug them enough maybe they'll give me some money up that'd be nice wouldn't it uh but they've been very nice to me i have to say uh they gave me free delivery they're lovely people here we go do you want to see it here's my i don't know if it's going to reach but we'll give it a go here we go here's the new computer Whee. it's very nice I like the new water cooler. The pipes actually look like they will shift water around rather than on my last one. There's like some little scrawny thing that like a children's drinking straw, which was no use when you're trying to keep temperatures down. Oh, my camera's got a jaunty angle to it now. See, <sighs> Come here. How's that? That's better. It is a sexy PC, isn't it? Very sexy. Right, we're going to draw these eyebrows. What did I say? Kind of a up, down. I think it's kind of like that. Let's see. No fill for you, please. I mean, that's fairly good, actually. My only problem is now I've got way too many and then of arched eyebrow this side mm. Maybe a bit too much is off. Yeah. Why are you moving everything? Don't move everything. Just move the one I want you to move, you swine. There we go. Zoom out a bit. It might be more useful to have this one on white. That's kind of... Hmm. What are we thinking? So look at it in place, shall we? Uh, turn everything on and off. Fun times. It's the only bit that's a ball ache. So we've got from 14, we need to change your opacity. Bonk. Uh, and we'll do it this way as well. That's about right, actually. Let's have a look. You're still so sad with Don't be sad. Yeah. That shine's come back. Why did I... That, what, what, why, is, why is the shine back? Oh, because there's two, you idiot. So where's the other one? You. Bye. I think I missed the teeny bit of uh, grey there. It's very subtle. Let's get rid, though. Hmm. 
And it's looking pretty reasonable, I have to say. Now, we're going to be 15, I reckon. There we go. Ah, blooming anchors. Change back to that. You. I think that bit there. Confused is what we're going for. Actually, Mr. Cotlotlish. You've got to change names. It's just unpronounceable. Um, this area, that looks too curved I want it to go more like that I want it to be more concave than convex would be my thing yeah Yes, that's the problem. <laughs> that's more like it. We can keep that. So it's still raised a bit. And I think that I'll. Yeah. That's a little bit extreme. So it sh it kind of should be a nice line through there. I also want to change that. Fifteen. There's too many layers, but once it's done, it's done. That's actually, yeah, it conveys what it's like. Bleh. Really? Bleh. Bleh. Suave. Suave is next. And then we're done. That needs renaming. You have Suave. Useful for whenever he's showing off, which is often because he's Weeble. So it's suave, it's more raised eyebrow. Hmm, should we've gone for him? So. Hmm. It's more of a raised eyebrow, isn't it? And he's very arched. All right. Hey, low jam. Thank you for the follow. I should make that bigger so I can actually see it. I got no, I can't. Right. So we've gone from. We need suave. Suave is our last point of thing. Thing we can probably keep the eyebrows actually. No, let's do new eyebrows. So, suave, you want to look suave, you go, hmm, hmm, so a sort of downy eyebrow. <laughs> Which one's the raised eyebrow, though? I'm looking at you. I think it's down to what hand you use, doesn't it? Isn't it? Okay, let's try these. Mango! 
So it's sort of do it. Mm. I don't know. Ah, no, don't join that. Convey suaveness or smugness, rather, it really. I think he's going to be all in this. No, come here. Here. It might be a bit too extreme. Maybe that. I'm not convinced by this one. eyes closed a little bit. What would the eyes do? Also, where does it exist? It is that. Hello, you. Need some positional stuff here. No, you, no, 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 ah, no, I've done it, I've just, I've, I'm just, I'm just messing up. I don't know that the smaller eyebrow is, I think it goes down, I think, like, if you, if you try and look smug, what's your small eyebrow doing? Close your eye a little bit. This is the thing. Punk. Now. What the what? Hmm. Ah, what, what the hell's that one then? Um, oh man. I've done the wrong ellipsis. It's fine. Oh, I keep doing that. Stop it. Clearly. Right, let's just confirm that I have the right sir. Oh, what are you doing? Right. This will tell me everything I need to know. That's correct, I've done the right one. But it's not position I want, it's bloody scale. It's fine, it's fine. Right, so now when I do it, I have the correct things. Hooray for me. Let's get rid of these eyebrows in places where we don't need the suaveness to change. Did we not have... Oh. Um, <laughs> it's not showing the layers I just made because idiot boy here... Uh, hasn't put in the things he needs. 
morning chooser. Right. Quizzical. Swap. I put these in the wrong place. go. Cover this keyframe to be. Uh, boom. So we're going to make these eyes a little. Now we can hide all the craft. 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 What is going on? Sorry. So many screens. Right, scale, scale, take it back to the start. So, sort that out. Or even start. Okay, so we're going to make this eye short. No, not you. This eye. Shorter. Is I bigger? It's kind of. Doesn't look suave yet, though, does it? Hmm. Better. Better. I'm wondering if he needs to be sort of. How do you get that? Oh. Maybe if I like bring this side of the eye down, actually, I'm going to need another shape. Sort of give him a sort of appearance. Ah, oh, you you cock that out. Right, here we go. I do need a solid fill. I don't need a stroke. That sounds rude. Be that far out. Though. Right. So if I put that, why is it twenty? What the hell? Do, 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 do. Right. So, let's try and figure this out. I don't think that's quite right either. Hmm, it's almost there. Wait, it's this eyebrow. Yep. All right. Where's where's twenty? I'd love to know what shape twenty is. I don't think it's anything. It wasn't anything. Look at that.
I've got it. I might want to move that right eye up a bit. See if that helps. It's your. I think that was a bit of a stupid thing to do. Because apparently there are no other keyframes. So let's not do that just yet. Let's sort this out first. So we've got a keyframe now. Okay. And obviously this shape is not quite right now. This is fun, isn't it? Fun animation. You know. That looks pretty good. Maybe the cyber owl needs to go down this one. Oh, I really need to change the air. Uh... Yep. Oh, yeah, that's it. So I need to. Ah! Layer 21. Is it you? It is you. Hooray. Just wondering why the... Theoretically, no, things are not quite right still. We're probably in the wrong place, Muppet. So that is quizzical, and then it is suave, pretty suave. We we'll probably go suave. That's going to do for now. Yay! Hooray! So what I really want to do is move Poeyball. To a new thing. I also want to move these all down. I think this should just let me do it. Nope. Something weird has happened there. It's strange that there's... Um... Oh, I see. It's fine. I can just make the canvas bigger if I need to. Right, let's move you, Mr. Joystick, and uh, I swap to a different layer. I want to move that to Dead Clown. So there's an expression that's wrong. It's the ice swap layers. Weeble ice. Of Weeble ice. 15 in comp layer of Weeble ice. I said, no, you, you, 
you're all wrong because you're in Weeble Rocker and you need to be in Dead Clown. And then it should work again. So what I'm doing here is moving the eye controller up to the main composition, which is where we want it to be. But because this is all made by me rather than some fancy plugin, um, it's a lot messier. There's no quick way. I'm sure I could just figure out a way to do it with some crazy null marker -y thing. Which means I only have to change one line, but I haven't. And again, I'm a tool. So what I really need to do is save all this. Wait, well, okay. Opacity line from 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 name dead clown is I've. <laughs> I put a capital L in. It needs to be precise. Yay. Oh, why is it wor not working? Oh, because... Capital L's. Right, what's it wrong now? Layer two. Weevil eyes fifteen. What? Show me. If comp the clown layer. Weevil eye swap. I actually pasted it in here. No, I haven't. Why did it get renamed then? Now it's the right name. Something is a bit messed up. Very much so. <sighs> Pasty of layer two. Weevil eyes and comp weevil eyes. Show me. Ah. Have I fixed it? Yes. 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 Those lines are very thick. Oh, hello. I see you. There's a bit of a thing there. Which one is that? Miffed. Look there. Stop moving things. Stop moving things. Fixed, 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 not fixed, wait, fixed, yep, I don't know why I turned that back on, and swap, everything works, hooray, so let's also move that joystick 
you. I can move via. I need to turn on the window with joysticks and sliders on. There we go. This grip requires. Uh, this is the thing in. Um, obviously, having changed everything to a new computer and reinstalled everything, there's still little things you miss every now and again. So I need to let. Allow scripts to write. Okay. I'm going to hide this while I try and find my license code. <laughs> Joysticks and sliders. You can look at me while I find codes that are missing. Missing codes. Wait, and this looks good. No, I hit it. I find found the uh, license code then. I think I have. How are we all doing? I found it. Here we go. Marvelous. Do not paste this into the chat. Hurrah! Cool. Where to put it? Oh, put it here. No, I won't. Maybe I will. There we go. Brilliant. That's not ideal. That's not worked. But it kind of has. There we go. All right. So, now I can move the joystick. Select the joystick layer. And move to Dead Clown. Move it. Punk. There we go. So in Dead Clown, I can now control my Wibble and Burb. Let's just try and check it, check it. Yeah, baby. <laughs> so Weebles in the main timeline, uncontrollable. But he's far too large. He still looks too large. That looks about right, but then Bob's going to be the craziest one. How about that? Does that work for me? Kind of works for me. All right. Can I move this completely? Oh, it doesn't show you if I do that, though. <laughs> it's the only problem. Okay, should we see where we're at? <laughs> so why is that going slow, slow, is your question? I think it's because we're in full mode. There we go. Let's swap to half. <laughs> So he needs to start. He's laughing, <laughs> but then he kind of goes contemplative, contemplative, con, 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 con contemplative. He's, he's contemplating. He's so laughter. <laughs> Zooming a bit. It's far too. <laughs> 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 got some issues what's going on with the sound here mm. Mm. Try this. all right 
show me that. So we have, I'm gonna need a chip box. Is this gonna be annoying? It may be. Let's see. So we start off happy. Punk. Punk. <laughs> I can't help feeling we need to go from happy to transition to normal. And then a little bit sad, maybe. Is he sad though, or is he just like... <laughs> now I think we go back to normal. <laughs> Not quite there. Is he miffed? No, he's not miffed. I think we can maintain it at normal there. Oh, for God's sake, not again. <laughs> oh, I'm such a tool. I'm just going to have to delete that scene on. <laughs> I've done so much. And it's just been poking at the point in my face. Oh, what a muppet. Right. <laughs> Let me show you what I've done. <laughs> God, where were we at? So we did the joystick thing and then I moved it. So everything's on the main timeline now. Blah, blah, blah. This is where everything's going to be. This is where all the action is going to happen. Um, and we've got this. No, <laughs> then. So there we go. I've animated his eyes. No, no, no. And Bo then Bob arrives, so we need to start Bob, obviously. Bob's going to be tricky because it's going to be a lot of renaming things. It's going to be deathly dull, basically, but, you know, <laughs> we'll get there and it'll be fine when it's done. It'll be fine. Yes, it will. Yes, it will. It'll be fine. Um, let's put in the titles as well, actually. Yeah. Because what's Weeble and Bob? 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 Weeble and Bob! What's Weeble and Bob without, you know, the little titles at the top? It's nothing. It's nothing. The... Now, how was it done? Oh man, surely I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to find an image of the thing. Here we go. Thank you. It's all lowercase, of course. Everyday happenings of Weeble and sometimes Weeble's friend, Bob. Can we not make this bigger? Whoa, it's the band episode. Whoosh. All right. So it's a white line. White lines. The air. Why are you not typing? The, what are you doing? 
Uh, let's start again with the text layer. For every day adventures people and weebles Bob nice perfect font as well well chosen font mm -mm. let's let's sort this out it's actually proper nice There we go. No, it used to be Ariel, but Ariel sucks as the font. He doesn't suck. It's just like a, a, a slightly nasty Helvetica. Which I have Helvetica. So why wouldn't you use Helvetica? And the answer is I prefer Futura now. Oh uh, yeah, Futura baby. Hmm. That's a nice one. But that's too light. That's about right. This is totally not title safe or anything. If you are a TV person. And I've missed some times there. I thought it was a bit short. There we go. Goodbye, Katolish. Katolish. Right. We're going to make this bit grey because that's what it was. Oh man, that does not work on there. Right, there we go. And this bit needs to be bolder. Bold. That's too bold. And medium's not bold enough. I could actually faux bold this bit, maybe. And that's probably it. Man, that is just clashing like hard on your eyes. But never mind, that's how it is. It's just how it was. It's just how it always. Ooh, let's be fancy, actually. Don't point the finger. Are you blaming me too? If the shoe fits, you wear it. I only wear sneeze. We can mope you in a merit. We should be two pixels so it doesn't go freaking crazy on TVs and douche look at that that kind of works it's a little bit fancier than it used to be which is nice um bum 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 all right cool I'm gonna move this up a layer I'm going to lock those. I'm actually going to lock this one. This should be underneath for now. And oh, we're good. All right, so Weevil is working. Bob, on the other hand, is going to be such a ball ache. It's going to be a load of me just changing sliders and scripts. It's going to be dull as all hell for everyone to watch. What are we having going? Eh. Do you want to see the toys we've got? We've got some cool toys. Neon over blue. Neon over blue. 
Yes, our, our vinyl toys arrived today, the prototypes. I got very excited. I'll show them off properly later on, actually. Right, let's try. <laughs> It'd be nice to have it all working. What do I need to do? Yeah, this is going to be an absolute hellish nightmare. Let's have a look at Weevil Eyes. It's going to be a hellish nightmare. What does this null do? I don't know. Oh man, right here we go. You know what? Let's let's take a break from Weevil and Bob, actually. We'll save where we're at. Because it is gonna be deadly though. I'll show you the old one that I did actually. And you'll you'll see the issue. I think it's this one. Not completely sure. Have a look. Yes. No, it's all messy and blah. And, and it's so slow to do anything. I thought I'd be fancy and have textures and stuff. The only thing is more animated at the moment. It's got these little shiny things. And there's noise on the shadows. Like, it's kind of nice. But there's no way... That you can work with something that takes that long to wobble a, sh a shape that is basically that simple it's ridiculous rubbish 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 so yeah that had to go uh yeah 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 so while we're here let's let's try and uh let's Lovely viewer. Z I assume there's more than one. Ten. Hello, ten people. Um, let's draw a thing from scratch. We're going to use potentially rubber hose, which I've hopefully got installed. So look. Joystick sliders on the rubber hose too. Brilliant. I'm kind of learning rubber hose still, um, but it's kind of fun. So rubber hose is a wonderful thing, unless you do limbs in a nice way. Give me an animal, give me an item, give me something that you want to be a character in the chat and we'll try and make that, we'll try and do that as a character. You'll have like until the thing updates and then we'll do the thing. Join in, why not? Come on. Get involved. Ooh, past this. No one. I know you're up there. Rhino. It's a good shout. Thank you, Super. F oh, Mr. Junks. Oh, we've gone. We're going for a very similar a bee. Bees don't really have like bendy limbs. A camel elephant. We, we, you know what? We could do a few. I quite fancy doing a rhino, though. I really fancy doing the rhino. Let's see what we can do. What colour should the rhino be? I mean, grey's boring. Right, here we go. Those curves need to be more. Let's go for some sort of flat design thing here. Is that a good shape? It needs to be more round, that's for sure. I think it needs to be shorter as well, more stocky if we're going to do this. Let's get up a rhino picture. Is it a rhino? It is, isn't it? 
Let's have a look at him. Hmm. Oh, if it's, he's gone again. This is uh, After Effects, Mr. Junks. Mm, do, do have the problem that he's not really... Uh... Yeah, screw it. We'll see what we can do. Where's my, where's my picture? Though? It's not a horse. It's a rhino. So we've got two ears. Basically, I wish I could just sketch this in something. There's nothing to stop me sketching it, actually. Let's let's move to Flash briefly. You, you won't be able to see. Do you not use Flash animation anymore? That's Mr. Junk. Not really. I use it for sketches, basically, and that's it. I do not like Flash. I haven't liked Flash. It doesn't work for me. I think if you're doing more frame by frame and stuff, it's, it's all right for that. Um, and every now and again, if you just got to smash something out and it doesn't really matter yeah flash is okay but i just don't I, I think the drawing tools on it are really flaky for a start and they have been since version 8 it just does weird blobs you'll not be able to see what i'm doing now tough ha <laughs> but it won't take long um where are my tools there we go did you, did you know? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking. I think that should be there. You know, surprise you, my lovely rhino, in a second. Yes. Really? It's kind of nice. It doesn't look right, but I'm getting there. You mm, got quite a nice animatable character pose. Clever here. Yeah. Might as well be on my face again at the moment. I'm just wondering about the eyes. I like that. All right, I've got my design. I'm done. We're going to fancy it up in After Effects. That is not how you spell right now. And part. Can you see him? Ah, oh, little, little cutie. Blah. Excuse me. Ooh, an hour to go and then I'm off to get hench. What do you think? We like him? I like him. I'm going to lose that shape I did. We're going to draw it a bit more nicely. All right, here we go. So try and keep a sort of flat designy thing going on because I'm kind of obsessed. If anyone has seen when I was he called, um, Hey Dougie. It's kind of amazing. Like the style of it. There we go. 
go to that here. Gentle curve there. There's a gentle curve. Happy trees. There we go. And can we? Kind of cool. It's a good shape. So I'll show you some hay, Dougie, to show you what I mean. Uh, where are you hiding? That's not it. Oh, good stuff, me. Uh, there we go. Hey, Dougie. Hey, Dougie makes more sense. Look at that. So this, this is the, look how gloriously flat it is. Like very subtle shading there and there. I love the eyes and the, yeah, it's kind of beautiful. But this sort of thing where it would be like really good for um, rubber hose, the way the limbs go and everything, like kind of just little hose pipes that you just bend. Uh, it's not going to work for this rhino unless we make it a more anthropomorphized, anthropomorphized kind of uh, fella. Oh, we totally could though. Let's go with this for now. Yeah. This would be good for like showing off the basics of um, linking stuff together and everything in After Effects as well. Now, I kind I kind of want to keep that straightish edge there. I might, oh no! Don't do that, you you butts. It's confused at the moment, clearly. You are confused, but don't worry. I'm not worried. No, you butts. Nice. Well behaved. Do, 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 do. Normally I don't I don't do my curves this well. It's just going right for me today. Side this. Join this on. I want to sort. Of, I want this bit here to be more. I want it to be more. I just want it to be more, man. I think it's kind of. If I do that, this curve is. It's fine. Hey, Tiles44, nice to see you. It's a pretty good shape. I wonder if it should go in more, like, sort of. I did not, I don't know what I did there, but it's not what I meant to do. Um, so this, I'm wondering if he needs to go up more at This is kind of sort of like that. But now having seen it. Oh, oh.
Mm. No. Ow. Nice ears, Titan. Time for ears. So on things like this, we need to change the anchor points so everything starts behaving like a sensible thing. The head will rotate there-ish. Now we've got the rotations in. I can rotate it. You are not quite right. What's you? He's all right. It's just this one that's a bit butts. So I want it to be slightly wider. Uh, there we go. So we're going to put some shading on these guys. Ah, oh, the new PC is good, Tiles. It's it's flying along. It is flying along at a speed that is unreasonable, and it's running cold and cold, like 40 degrees even now, I imagine. It's, I, 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 it has a temperature thing. It has a flap. I love my flap. Currently, how old are you? Oh, shit. Don't pull it like that. It's either 32 or something else. 32. That's the CPU. It's 32 degrees. Ridiculous. Everything's cold. It's just freezing cold. I'm hotter than the room. The graphics cards are the hottest thing, and even that's only 38 degrees. It is ludicrous speed. It's like 4.2 gigahertz with eight cores or something. I don't know. It's this is fast. The only thing I I think it, it needs is like maybe more memory. But even then, it doesn't seem to be struggling because it has speedy memory in. Cyber power. Get all your PC needs fulfilled. My <laughs> cyber power. Yes. I'm, I'm good at advertising people. I'm going to write him a song to say thank you. It could well be a fridge. I might put my Coke in there to keep it cold. Right. Uh, eyes would be good. Let's sort out some eyes. Let's have a look at Hey Dougie again. I've closed the window with Hey Dougie in, haven't I? Idiot. This is fine, though, because we shouldn't be copying other people's work. I want an eye thing, eye type shape. Hmm. Not quite black, but similar. Question is to copy or. Hmm. So yeah, you can spend ages just faffing with the eyes on these things till you, you get happy. I do. Realistically, I should have put this bit on its own layer, so we should have had a kind of that as a lump, and then this bit as a lump. There's a B, there's a B, and um, and then the horn, and then we could actually do full head swings, which would be really good. Maybe I should do that now. Should we do that now? Let's do it now. Let's break his head down into its constituent parts. Oh, what's going to happen with the eye occlusion? It's not a problem. Because if we rotate the head, we'll do it so he kind of goes boom, like that. And then he'll sort of maintain. Great idea. I'm going to do it. I will do it, Tiles. I will. 
You can't stop me. Man, it is ridiculously hot in this room. How is it that the PC is so cold and I am so ridiculously hot? I'm going to open the window. It's going to change the lighting and everything. I don't care. It's too hot. Don't look at my pants. too hot oh, okay okay right okay so sneaky thing to do would be let's change the thing of it fill on this Okay, so let's figure this out. So you've got a shape there. This will be a shape. It's going to change the design a little bit. This will be a shape and this will probably be a shape. There is the problem with this. I have a... I have a sneaky plan actually because the thing I'm using works best if you're not actually manipulating like the shape paths it's fine with scaling it's fine with moving but as soon as you start faffing with shape paths you get into territory you get into territory you don't want to be in territory so we've got a kind of shape here that all kind of is going to need to rotate but it's also slightly weird and wonderful in too many things I think that's pretty good it's, it's, it's gonna be impossible to tell until we're done so that this one's gonna do is kind of swing by that as we do it so we can maintain a more basic shape underneath that you are going to be a different color now. You're going to be that color, so we know where we are. It should work. We'll see. And this anchor point will be something like there as it swings. There we go. Part one of extravagant shape makey thing. So, got that. No, 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 no. So this shape is going to be kind of symmetrical. I don't think I did a very good job at that bit. We'll sort it out in a minute. We can move point to wherever we want.
wonder if uh... there we go this could work it could be horrible and and fail miserably we won't know till we try whereas this one's rotation point is Kinda here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So another shape. So this is a shape. What happened there? Oh wow. That's what happened there. I think that is kind of like the other shape, so I can probably sure on it a bit. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> So we got that, we got that, we got that, we've got that. We don't have. Let's have a look at it. It's sort of working. This one needs to be lower. Curve it a bit to soften everything just in case. Horn time. Now, oh, we'll just do a, tri a soft triangle for this one, actually. Otherwise, we're just going to enter a world of pain at later points. That should work. I might add there we go some I'm wondering if that's acceptable so as we rotate it we'll just rotate the horn slightly it'll maintain it'll maintain it's got to maintain where's it gonna rotate probably about there oops in like 50 things I didn't mean to Tiny horn. What have I done? I've got, I've turned this horn black somehow. Let, let's make it the right color, shall we? Pow. All right. So theoretically, I can now rotate a thing. Ears. Old head. Let's get rid of you. Eyes. Eyes are here. What has happened there? That's interesting. Why is that? Why have I done that? How have I done that? Should we delete the bits we don't need? Bonk, bonk, and then you, bonk. There, right, so we have eyes. Short on. Long on. We need a mouth, of course. Body. 
we may need to change that as well if we're gonna do nice head rotations yeah we do um, okay you are I don't know what you call this it's like a head base this is kind of nose area that's kind of forehead right here left here right right skull cap <laughs> it's not a skull cap where is this gonna rotate that's a tricky one I'm gonna say between the eyes it kind of makes sense this is gonna rotate so tricky why is this changed you're gonna rotate there these are still right that's still right that is way off we're going to rotate there. You I kind of guessed it would be somewhere crazy. So we have a, a head shape. We need a mouth. I want a mouth before we do anything else. No. What colour should his mouth be? I wanted something nice. I don't want black. That kind of works. Look at that. Come on, just do another line there. Maybe a bit thinner for you. There we go. Oh, look at his new, look at his new mouth, eh? This is pretty cool. He does actually need a nose area, probably. I want to change those ears to, um, we're going to use a gradient fill on these puppers. I just make my life easier. Fills, 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 ill, ill, ill. Always so tricky to figure this bit out. Here we go, here we go. My end point. See, somewhere around here is the fill. There it is. This is what I need. I want a bit, nothing too crazy. There we go. Nice. Ah, and we're going to change you to gradient fill as well. Theoretically, we can change this one to a gradient fill.
I'm not sure I do want it to be. Maybe it needs to be a round one. That's pretty good. All right, let's see what we can do here. So, I think a useful thing to do generally is join all the things that we need to join together. Oh, mouth. So the mouth is joined to the, say, nose area. Log on is definitely joined to the area. Um, and the eyes potentially also nose area that could also be head base nose area is joined to head base forehead is joined to the head base right ear is joined to forehead and left ear is joined to forehead and head base is joined to body so now when I move body everything moves do you see cool and when i move head base if i do a rotate everything should be there look you see get down Ooh, doo, doo. that's all pretty simple and we can you know because we've got these ears these can wiggle and it's all good but what we really want is to be able to go like this with the head and i think we can and we're gonna find out the main tricky bit here is gonna be the midpoint i should think Because we should have some occlusion over, like the horn should go in front of the eyes and so on. What we may need to do is put in a subtle layer, just kind of here in front of the eyes. Which let's let's do that now. Question is why is it? It's kind of just like a rounded. It doesn't even need to be that big. It just needs to be big enough to do the job. I'm going for a flat fill there. And we don't strike. There we go. The fill does need to be the right colour. Honk. Done. All right. It's rough. We'll see. We'll call this... I locker because it's a good it's a good name for such things all right so with joystick versus and sliders you need five five frames uh why are we in seconds can we not swap to um uh this is another thing when you it's going to be composition. Settings. No. Project settings. Here we go. Time display. On use frames, please. Also, base rate's going to be 24. And I'll do me. Right. Eight blocker, eye blocker. All right, so we've got the base position, which will be kind of looking straight at the camera, I guess. So we're not actually there yet. So the first thing we need to do is sort that out. 
And then, right, let's open this. So, joysticks and sliders. Here we go. So. Blah, blah, blah. Multidimensional controller. So you have the origin, which is straight on. Right. Stage right. Stage right. Then stage left. Then up and then down. So hopefully we've done enough that we can do that. So we can't really, this is, we've got stage right here. We've got him looking right. So we need to sort out the positions for everything. Position, 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 position. <laughs> Position, position. And we're not changing the body for this. We're just doing the head for this joystick. Probably need scale on some. So let's do that. Keyframes are all. And now we have scale and position. And we might need some rotation as well. Now when I go there, I have keyframes for all of those things. Hooray for me. Hooray. All right, let's sort this out. So, this is the central thing. I'm going to move that there. We're also going to scale it like so. Not you. We have a slight issue. It's fine. Do that. Oh, you're scaling the mouth as well. Never mind. Oh no. Yep. I think might actually work without the blocker. You never know. I do need to make this wider again. Where's my short horn? Yeah. You'll see what I'm doing. Right. This is more of a rotation. And we'll move him over there. And we've got this fella. Oh, shite. Everything's joined onto you, isn't it? Also, I want to move that. Straight up, down. Let's move the forehead. The fact we can't see the eyes is actually slightly annoying. Let's do this. And then we can move the eyes up. I'm fairly certain, yeah, that I don't want the eye blocker now. Let's move this. And this. And you. Hmm. 
Hmm. What do you think? Bonk. I mean, the eyes do get bigger, but... Can we live with that? It kind of works. Ears move. One, two. In you go. And you go there. And rotate a bit. And you need to rotate a bit too. So he kind of looks down a bit when he gets that way. Makes sense, yeah? Also want to move everything that way. Then we get to the other side. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh yeah. Let's let's move his head face again. Because we've swung right round. Bonk, bonk. actually easier because we do that rotate my big horn long horn And the shot goes about here. Where is it? Let's have a look. Try and maintain. I think his face actually needs to come out a little bit more. So like that. I'll do. What's the mouth do? What's the eyes do? More. Mouth to mouth. Ears. Do do do. do. Thank you, Agrillo Bob, I, for wishing me luck on my animations. We have no real plan for this, but you know, it's kind of a nice rhinos. So, we've got that. We kind of want that. Oh, we're going to need a keyframe for all these. Otherwise, it freaks out. It needs keyframes, so anything you've changed is the uh, main thing. I'm actually going to have to go out in a minute and do some fitness, you know. And next time I'm on, we will carry on with the Weeble and Bob. I will have sorted out the Bob element, which is the boring Bob element. That, you know, no, it's just so dull to watch, I'm pretty sure. So we're sorting you out hooking you up with the interesting stuff right so he's going to consider that origins punk and we go that's the origin so back here and place origin here as well all right so this is so we've done straight on right and left Why have you stopped showing me? I think it was up first and then down. I can't entirely remember. So we're going to hope for the best and do up first. So he's looking up. This is going to be all in. 
the nose area. The longhorn be mostly up. Maybe you can scale that actually. Mouthy mouth. I don't really know what we're going to do with the eyes here. That kind of works. I'll just move the ears out actually a bit. And rotate them. Get them back in. Where is the little horn? Do you want it in? We do need to move his hole. There we go. Oh no, he's gone off the top. That's fine. It's fine that he's gone off the top. We'll make the... And then looking down, which is going to be easy, hopefully. Mm. So we move everything down there, and then we move the nose area well and truly down. We give the. Um, oh. I want the eyes down a little. The ears. Potentially all right, actually. Yeah, you don't wanna. There we have it. Let's give this a go. So let's hide this. We'll hide the body as well for now. Yeah. So in everything select, we create a new joystick and we call it Rhino Head. Because <laughs> that's what you want. And it's done it. Let's move this away. Okay. Oh, that's not quite right. So we've got some issues like that. Actually, I quite like the fact that the horns flex, but not quite. You know what the problem is, is we've got no rotations there. Kind of still works. I mean, if you're quick, it works and that's fine. I really like the ears. We may need that um, nose blocker in. Up my eye blocker, rather. But yeah. If we sort that out, that's clearly too high. So we undo the joystick. Um, boom, 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 boom. There we go. So it's up that's our issue. Right. It's not that much of an issue, but it is a bit. It would be nice if it gave us ones for the um, looking up sort of thing. 
I guess. It's better. What we can do is just alter that shape, to be honest. I mean, that bit is peach keen. That's fine. So if we alter that little horn, it'd be all right. Hi. Have a look now. <laughs> I actually quite like that. That's weird, obviously, but that's that's kind of cool. I don't know why his eyes do that. Because, okay. So when we get over there. Hmm. This is fine, we'll just jiggy, jiggle them around a little bit more. And we'll be there. We'll have it sorted. Uh, yeah. Oh, unbind. Yeah, there's your problem. This song, man. Still not quite there on that side. But it's pretty good. It kind of falls apart there, not so much there. The reason it falls, uh, because that isn't. So it seems that we have the thing. I mean, that looks great. Let's buy this one more time. Go look at that one. Right, so. Our issue is your There we go. There we go. All right, we've got a pretty limber little rhino there. Turn on the body. Chonk. We'll give him some little legs. And then we can do stuff. He, he'd be a little animated fella. What were we, we were going to use? Uh, how long have we got? 10 minutes. We can do this. Oh, there's one thing I want to be able to do, which is... Let me just see if 
check something. If I rotate him now, I want to attach everything. The head base. Here we go. And just want to check this. Look at that. All right, cool. This is why I love I love After Effects. Right, so got that. We got the thing. We don't have a body. We don't have a tail. Tail is not right. One tail, which is stupidly in front of everything else, which is not, it's not going to work. It's not going to pan out if we do let it stay there. Your rotation point is there. And the legs. Now we could go quite stumpy. It'd be nice to get some bend and stretch in them. So we're going to give uh rubber hose a go here yeah of course i paid for this so we're going for now hip to ankle i guess i haven't used this for a long time it kind of is nice when when it, when you manage to remember how to use it new rubber hose He's there. And look, it's very bendy, which is awesome. But I'm not sure which way it is. <laughs> As you see, it is a little bit big. So, what can we do? Rename selected. Uh... Oh. No, I know there's. Here we go. Hose length. Hose. Mm. Mm. Talking of songs. I'm altering that. That's no good for me. Ah, there we go. So we got a grey jibby doo doo doo, but it's going to be like that. And I'd like it to have a flat foot, which I think I can do. Style. Ah, stroke one. Cap. Here we go. Butt cap. Clearly what we want. And there we go. Join. That there, and then doopy doop doopy doop. Do you see? Do you see? He's gonna be all suave. So the hip needs to join too. The body, of course. Also, now we've done all the um, facey stuff. We can hide it and just use the controller. When I say hide it, chad it. You know, chad. But what no whatever's. You know the fella. This well, click that chads. I I want to leave the head base there because we like the rotating bit. A bonk is done. This is hidden. Right. I saw that there was a thing where I can duplicate it, wasn't there? New rubber house. 
alt duplicate auto flop that did not duplicate it at all did it right copy house style no it's not doing it is it paste house style to selected horse lay hose lay let's make a new hose then this is the ankle Why is he drawing a weird penis shape? <laughs> hey, it works. All right, cool. All right. We didn't really do much to it, so this is fine. It would be nice if we tapered a bit, I guess. I'm sure we can do that. I forget you can attach it to shape layers now. Hmm. Oh well. So we want to attach the hip to the body. In theory, if I move this now. Oh, look, that's interesting. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> that's fun it's it's not exactly why but i i i'm i'm not hating it oh man i've totally got to go um let's put it, quickly put the um i've totally got to go Make a new house. New house. And we're gonna paste the style of the house. You. No. There. Uh, paste. You're gonna be. Thank you. It's so long and weird, isn't it? There we go. Two. What did he see? I'll make that slightly darker, actually. Also, move it behind the body, because that's a sensible thing to do. You. There you go. And what did you do? I want to copy the layer. Make one more. Find that, paste that. That doesn't look like it's copied it at all. Oh, uh, how annoying. Ah, oh, you mother. Right. There we go. All right, nice one. Ankle here. <laughs> Ankle is here. New tail. Hip is there. And it needs to be a whole lot shorter. There. <sighs> Hip needs to be joined to the body. Hip needs to be joined. That's it. Everything is joined to palm. Is 
So if I do this. Could do with making him a bit longer. Wait on the cusp of being able to bend. There you go. So he's going to walk nicely. Yes, Sketchly, I'm making the entire thing in uh, After Effects because, you know, he, he had. And why not? Why wouldn't you? Made by robots. See robots. So sexy. Sexy too. Where's the tail gone? Why was the tail hidden? Does anyone know? Did I hide it? There we go. So, obviously, I can attach the toes to the body as well, and then it will. He won't look like he's glued to the floor anymore. But it does make certain things simpler to have him do that, and yeah. So there we go. We have a hippo that can look around. Probably need some sort of shadowy thing there. But hey, hello, hello, hello. See how quickly we made that? You can't tell me that's not, you know, a worthwhile thing to do. We save this. What should we save it as? I have a whole new disk drive. Screw it, we'll put it on here. Oh, I have two new folders. I'm going to have to pop off now. Thank you all for watching now. Hope, you, hope it was enjoyable. Um, we can do some quick animated things another time with him. But next time we'll be finishing off the Weeble and Bobs and doing all that malarkey. I'm going to swap the face cam and no doubt forget to swap back again. But it's fine because we're finished now. And there you go. Goodbye, all. If you enjoyed the stream, please uh, follow and do that. Um, we have a Patreon. It's very helpful to us because we like to pay our animators properly as much as we can. And, and support from the Patreons lets us do that, basically. Um, so, yeah, if you, you wish to help out and you can help out, that'd be great. And don't forget, we've also got a Kickstarter for toys that um, I will be showing off later this evening or probably on YouTube or whatever. But yeah, thank you. Uh, take care. Have a good day. All right. Goodbye.